Project NOAA has developed an early warning system that will allow users to see and monitor incoming weather disturbances. These tools give people the ability to make informed decisions as they are able to determine the dangers and risks a hazard can bring. The animated images from the Himawari satellite allow users to monitor storms that may enter the Philippine area of responsibility. The satellite image shows the size of the storm and the direction where it is headed. It can also show rain clouds which can indicate areas where it will rain. Given that a certain community experiences rainfall, Project NOAA is also able to monitor the amount of rain because the Doppler radar stations accurately display the coverage of the rain clouds. Thus, areas where it might rain are effectively marked out. If there is continuous heavy rainfall in the identified areas, the automated rain gauges in the upper parts of the watershed gather and record the amount of rainfall over a set period of time. If the sensors continue to display continuous rainfall, the next step is to check out the water level sensors. These sensors indicate the rise and fall of a river's water level. Continuous rainfall in the highlands make the river swell. You can use the water level sensors to detect whether or not a river is about to overflow. If the graph shows a continuous rise of water, then there is already a likelihood for flooding. All these sensors help LGU officials know how much time remains before the potentially damaging landslide or flash flood hits their community. To know which areas will be hit by landslides, flooding, or storm surges, you can check the hazard maps that are also in the Project NOAA website. The early warning systems combine the resources of several agencies of the Department of Science and Technology. This is to effectively highlight the maximum warning for every community. Coordinated emergency management using the reliable data from these hazard early warning systems can help achieve a hazard resilient society. Empowering communities with proper hazard and risk information allows for timely and responsive preparations even before a hazard hits. This can lead to zero casualties. With proper planning and mitigation using science and technology, we are one step closer to a disaster-resilient Philippines. Visit noaa.dosd.gov.ph to know your hazards.